What's up everybody? Well, I got another gameplay video for you guys today, and today we're gonna check out body cam on the main PC here. Now, the secondary PC ran it pretty damn good, so I was curious how it was gonna go on these other two PCs, these other two desktop PCs, and I'm hoping that it'll be able to be playable, but 4K is a lot harder to run, but it is more powerful than the 7900 XTX2, so I'm hoping that a little extra power will keep let us get very similar FPS to the uh, 7900 XTI. But we'll see. So hope we'll see what the 4090 can do with a 1300 KF. So let's not waste any more time and hop on into the game. All right, so here's the settings we're gonna start with. Well, except for that, we definitely don't want that. I don't know why that was like that. Anyway. Now for graphics. All right, now let's go hop into the game. All right, let's see what kind of FPS we get. around, move the camera around, so yeah, so far I don't think it's dropped under 60. At least on this map. This might be the easiest to run map out of all of them too, so I don't want to sit there and say it'll never drop under 60 with these settings, but. And since the game has forced upscaling, it's never true native resolution no matter what you pick. But this is still the highest res we're gonna get. I mean, unless some people are playing at 8K with upscaling, that, that would definitely be higher than me. If I remember that, I think I, got, I think I got killed, or I killed somebody here, and then I got blown up by a bomb right here. So it's cool that I killed the dude, but not very cool that I got blown up by a bomb. itch on my nose but I don't want to take my hand off the mouse so I'll just use the tripod there we go that's so much better Yeah, this game looks great though. It's crazy how realistic you can make a game look. I could get better at going through those. Anyway though, now just for fun for the people that would rather have FPS rather than graphics, we'll put everything on low. All right, now we're gonna turn everything down to low. So still at 4K, no locks of FPS of any kind, all this stuff's left alone. And all we left on Epic was the view distance. And then this, cause you only got Epic or high, so when we're trying to do everything on low, the high, we'll go with the lowest one, you know? So now, let's go hop back into the game and see how it does with these sets. Alright, here we are in the game with everything on low, and it's getting very similar FPS to what the uh, secondary here is getting. Oh, cool, we got a person. 
All right, I don't mind going as one person. I still don't know how to defuse the bomb, so I'll still lose, but... Phone silence, that still goes off. I think it's time to move on and wrap this video on up. Well, all right, guys, that's a wrap for body cam on the main PC here. And it seemed to get acceptable FPS, whether you are on Epic or if you want more FPS, you're just putting it low. And it seemed to get around like 110 to 118, at least on that map. There's plenty of maps though. So I might've just picked the easiest one to run. I obviously didn't do that on purpose, but I have no idea how, how this game works and what all maps are all that. Somebody just wanted to see how this game ran on the Asus G15 Advantage, so I figured I'd run it on everything. But in any case, that is all I got for you guys for this particular video. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, because I sure as hell enjoy making it for you guys. And until the next video, peace out, guys.